So coming up to Easter, we did some different enrichment today for the chimps, so we prepared a little bit of an Easter egg hunt. Um, so we got some paper mache eggs, I got some of the volunteers and the BSU um, guys to help me out and make some eggs, painted them, made them very pretty and put them all, all throughout the exhibit, so tried to hide them as much as possible, put them up high, hide them in the logs, wherever we can, just to make it a little bit harder for them to find it. And when they did find them, it was all very, very exciting. Yeah, so we let them out. It's a little bit different. They don't usually get their enrichment in the morning. They usually get it throughout the day or in the afternoon. Yeah. So it was all very, very exciting. They all came running out, um, didn't even look at, at the food that was meant to be there, um, went straight looking, looking for these eggs and started collecting them. So some of them went far because they thought there'd be more over there and some stayed closer. So it was great to see them all reaching out and, and searching for those eggs. So. So in eggs we put some of their normal sort of enrichment mix, so some mm -hmm. of their leaf eater pellets, also some sultanas, pellets and a little bit of uh, freshly popped corn as well which they loved. So it, it, we sealed them up completely so I had to rattle them around a bit to see what was in them um, and they just pretty much ripped them straight open. It was awesome to see um, they, they all came out and, and making some very nice vocals, very happy vocals which you don't really see on a, on a daily basis. It was very, very nice to see that they, they absolutely loved their enrichment. Yeah, so some of them got one egg, some got more. So we, we put about 30 eggs out, out in there. Um, having 19 chimps, it means that everyone at least got one. Some of them got more. So uh, one of our, our younger females, Lani, actually managed to get four today. So she, she saw the opportunity and she ran and grabbed four of those eggs and went and sat somewhere where no one would bother her. Um, and she got the whole jackpot. So it was awesome to see um, that for this enrichment, some of the, the lower ranking um, females in the group also got, got to enjoy their Easter egg hunt. Yeah, so it's not something that we do every day. Uh, this is called novel enrichment. So it's something different um, and exciting. And it, it's great for the group. It's great for their, their bond together and sharing um, their food and that sort of thing. You know, it's not like handing the food on, on a platter. They get to actually manipulate the item to get the food out. So it's something different and exciting. Um, and it really keeps, keeps the group really active and, and entertained throughout the day. Um, we did see Sudi, one of the, um, our youngest, so I think he's uh, nine months old now, and um, whilst Sheba, his mum, was, was having a bit of a forage there, um, Sudi was then playing in the wrapping paper of, of that egg. So yeah, the infants are obviously enjoying the enrichment as well, which is great to see.